Do you know the feeling of being lost? When you feel like no one understands you? That feeling when no one can help you or shake your hand. That time when you want to give up and leave everything behind. That feeling you get when life has betrayed you. That was exactly what I felt like when my best friends of 10 years betrayed me right before a big exam. That put an end to my perfect grades in Morocco and stopped me from wanting to go to school ever again. I have cried so many times. I have pushed away my family, even my mother, the only person that has and is still standing by my side. Some days, I would wake up so late, but I didn't regret it, because at least I was waking up. Then one day, I've met my wonderful husband. And after two years of marriage, I came to the United States. And after only one month, I decided to join Europe. I was so excited to be a part of the program. I did not know English, and I had no job experience. But I had to explore my passion for IT. All I had was my husband, but nothing could take away my excitement. I had too much energy to achieve my dreams. This whole journey has not been easy on me. I had had to deal with racism on the bus and on the train. I have heard mean things said about me simply because of who I am. Things so bad that I've cried in public restrooms. I did not want to make friends a year because I was afraid that they will betray me as well. But I talked to my coach I've received so much LC support that it changed my mind. And now, I am no longer the old for those. Because of the all support that I've received a year up, I decided that it was time to use all bad words and all the bad attitude as a fuel for my growth instead of tools for my demise. And guess what? It works. <laughs> These experiences have taught me how to deal with oppression in a way that I was not being able to before. In the one year I've been in the United States, I've changed in so many ways. I am full of optimism. I am so proud of the person I am today. I am graduating from Europe now. <laughs> and I've completed an amazing internship at Lagmian, where I worked in hardware and desktop support. And I am prepared to embrace all the new opportunities coming my way. Today, I want to say, Alhamdulillah, thanks God. <laughs> and I am so grateful for my husband for believing in me my parents for supporting me, and for the year up stuff, for creating a safe place where I could learn. Now that this chapter of my journey is coming to an end, I look forward to visiting my mom in Morocco 
and furthering my studies in information technology when I returned to the US. If you only remember one thing from what I say today, I hope that you remember that it's okay to fail as long as you get back up to try again. Thank you.